Welcome back, everyone. It's Abdallah here with another exciting episode of Yokai Watch 3 on Nintendo 3DS. We are continuing the main story, so welcome to it. I hope you guys all have enjoyed the previous episode. I know Sailor Cuties and that whole dream sequence was totally one of my favorite things in the game so far. So, of course, our comment question of the day. Which member of the Sailor Cuties is your favorite and why? Oh, man. I like the blue one. The blue one's my favorite. Sailor Serenity, I think that's her name. Anyway. <laughs> It's not like they're like fully fleshed out characters or anything, but it's kind of cool. So here we go. Uh, we have Haley Ann and her brand new detective agency that we inherited from Mr. Goodsight. So I'm excited about that. Shoot. We ain't had one single darn request. There. Nothing's come in at all. Hmm. I thought there'd be at least one. Oh, what's this, a request? Haha, <laughs> let's see what excitement and adventure awaits us next. Welcome! What do you guys think it's gonna be? I'm curious. Scoop! Uncovering an underground mystery. Okay, well, I'm excited. Yep. It's Mr. Goodside. How are y'all doing? Oh, it's you. I thought it was a client. And there I was getting my hopes a soaring. Uh, I wish someone would come. Anyone. Now, is that any way to treat a visitor? Especially when that visitor is also a client. You've come to make a request. Well, why didn't you say so? You're as changeable as the darn weather. So, how can we help you? We specialize in catching villains, undercover operations, and... Now, now, just settle down. I've told Waper what I'd like you to do, so ask her for the details. You did, but when? Yeah, what the heck? Like, Waper, like, knew this the whole time? Unless, like, Good Sight and Waper have some sort of, like, psychic bond? <laughs> I don't know, man. But in the world of yokai, you never know. Okay, the Happy on Detective Agency takes on all manner of detective quests. Detective quests require you to be investigative. Uh, as your assistant, I compile client requests. Speak to me, Waper, to select requests. Go to the quest app to verify the investigations are underway. Set the nav and, and it guides you. Uh, you can cycle through objectives, too. Alright, well, let's go. There. Good morning. Here are your detective requests. Okay, so uh, the client is a troubled girl from Uptown Springdale. The detective agency takes on its first request. And you get a cute bow for Mignon. Ho, oh, 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 Gizmonion. Gizmonion. Hey, hey, hey. Let's go. I gotta try to replicate Gizmonion. Uh, there's a girl in trouble. We gotta do something. It looks like you'll have to ask her in person in Uptown Springdale about it. Okay, then let's go. Come on, Usapion. Darn tootin'. Okay, meet with a client in Uptown Springdale. Oh, come on, man. Where's the Mirapo fast travel? Let's go. Oh, my. Ask and you shall receive. Holy moly. Hello. Uh, is this the Happy on Detective Agency? What's this? Another request? Welcome. No, this is my friend Mirapo. He's just come to visit. Mirapo, he looks just like a mirror. Hello, I'm not just a mirror, you know. I can warp people. Ooh, warp? That's amazing. Uh, we're gonna need to travel faster now that we're getting more requests. And Mirapo and friends can help us warp instantly from place to place. That's, well, my connected Wappy Wapkins uh, for you. What entire nation are you talking about? Aw, uh, what's wrong with Wappy Wapkins? Her name's Waper, Dag Nabbit. Waper. I don't know that many Mirapos, unfortunately. And if we want to warp to other places, uh, we'll need to find uh, some others first. So the plural of Mirapo is Mirapos. That's interesting. Wow. That's really interesting. Oh, don't worry about that. I'm just amazed we can work at all. I'm ready. Step through me and you'll be back home in no time. All right, back home in no time. I'm down. We can warp between the detective agency and back home. That's great. Okay, this is one small step for geek and one giant leap for geek kind. Okay, well, I'm, I'm down for that. Let's warp. Bleh, would you like to warp immediately? Yeah, let's go to, um... We can go to Breezy Hills. Uh, it's Uptown Springdale. No, we're gonna go to Mount Wildwood Shrine. Oh, to begin with, try warping your home? Come on! <laughs> Don't give me the options, then. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you, some sort of Mirapo? Mira Mirapo. Alright, so now we're home. Yay! Oh my gosh, it really works. I never thought I'd get to warp in my lifetime. Well, just, uh, life's just full of surprises with you, ain't it? Prepare yourself. Uh, for what? 
It's time to chill out to the max. Get on with the darn request, you varmin. Okay, uh, 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 alright, so I need to go out of here, and we need to find a little girl in Uptown Springdale. And I don't know if we can start going to, like, all the every marts now and start uncovering the Mirapo that are hidden in the bathrooms, or what? <laughs> Mirapo is the weirdest, yo, guy. Alright, anyway, so there's typically a, a Mirapo in the Gourd Pond Museum. I'm gonna go south to the store and double check to see if there's a Mirapo inside this store. But typically, wherever there's an Ipo, there's a Mirapo. So let's jump inside here. Let's check the bathroom out. And there's definitely no Mirapo. Okay, well, I don't know if that's gonna change. Again, I don't remember too much off of me playing this game fully three, two years ago. So anyway, we'll find out by the end of this Let's Play, so it really doesn't matter. All right. Here we go. We're going to Uptown Springdale. We're going to go check out Nate's house. And we're going to go check out Katie's house, too. <laughs> Nate's house. Who's going to move in? Is anyone going to move in? I don't think so. All right. So this is, uh, yeah, this is right over by Nate's house. Interesting. Okay, well, let's take this little shortcut here. Or not. Yeah, we could. Here we go. Okay. Hey, little girl. Hi, hi. I heard you were in trouble. Milky hasn't come home. Milky? My white cat, he's a, he's a, he's a red collar on. He's a red collar on? I, maybe the girl's just talking weird. That can't be a typo. I see, uh, hmm, where does Milky usually go? He always takes a walk around the park near here. I see, don't worry, leave it to me, I'll find him and bring him back. Really, thanks. So I'm looking for a cat now? Come on, I got better things to do. A cat, huh? Cats are great, aren't they? They're so cute. If I had the choice, I would have uh, I would have had a cat yokai for a partner instead of this. <laughs> what? Why, you? What do you mean this? Sorry, sorry. Right then. Let's find him. The park near here. Triangle Park, maybe? Yeah, let's go and see. Why would you say that? What is wrong with you? It, Usapian's right next to you. That's so rude. Wow, man, you need some social skills, girl. And here we are, Triangle Park. Time to gather info. Darn tune, let's ask around. All right, you guys seen any white cats? Looking for a white cat? He's a red collar on. Hey there, what's up? A white cat? Nope, haven't seen it. All right, how about you, you dad? Are you looking for something? A cat, huh? White? Nope, not seen one of those. All right, well, you? The mom? Uh, have you seen a white cat with a red collar? Oh, uh, I know that cat, the one that comes here often, right? Yeah, yeah. Actually, yesterday I saw a white cat at Mount Wildwood Shrine. Maybe it was him. Oh, the shrine. Thank you for your help. Okay, so we're going to go to Mount Wildwood Shrine and we're going to go find that cat. So, moral of the story, guys. If you own cats, don't put them outside. Cats should strictly be indoor. And yeah, I'm not telling you what to do, but for your cat's best interest, don't put your cats outside. There's so many different dangers and everything like that that uh, can totally take your cat away from you. You don't want that to happen. Bring your cats outside under supervision purposes only, like we do with our four cats. All, all four of our cats go outside, they eat the grass, but we make sure to watch them every time they do so. Because if you don't watch your cat and you let your cat outside, then, you know, maybe some wolves can get it, or it can get hit by a car, like Jibanyan. You don't want that to happen. So, repeat it with me now. If you guys have a cat, don't leave it outside, because its life expectancy will drop. <laughs> life lessons with Abdallah. We made it to Mount Wildwood Shrine. I wonder if there are any witnesses here, too. Ain't no harm in asking some yokai. Oh, I didn't think of that. Nice idea, Sapion. How about this cat? Can I ask this cat? Have you seen the cat? Oh, 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 Mr. E, what are you doing here? You seek a white cat, do you? Well, I've not seen it, but I've got something much more interesting than that to share with you. Come back to me when you're done looking for what you're looking for. <laughs> interesting, you say? We're looking for clues right now. Uh, it ain't just people that might have seen some. I reckon we ought to talk to yokai, too. Alright, so there's a yokai around here. Maybe in the tree? Maybe on the shrine? Komajiro? What? <laughs> what? Where? Oh, something around here. <laughs> Enerfly? Enerfly with an R. <laughs> I always get these two mixed up. Enerfly. 
Uh, this is the yokai Enterfly. Oh, hey you, have you seen a white cat anywhere? I did see a white cat. You sure? You know where he is? I saw him heading for the riverbank in Blossom Heights. Whoa, you really did see him. I'm always full of energy, you see. Haley, we gotta go to the riverbank. The riverbank in Blossom Heights? The heck, dude? I went all the way up here for nothing. Man, alright. Wow, that's not annoying. <laughs> maybe! Hold on, maybe I could warp with Mirapo. Dang it. Alright, well, that's a missed opportunity. Alright, it's already too late. There's an old granny in the parking lot. I'm not going to try to help her reach her destination. Not today, granny. Not today. Oh, you want to do a bike ride? Oh, okay. Here, we could do a bike riding tournament. I could beat you. Now remember Yokai Kart? Oh, man. Did I tell you the story of Yokai Kart? Oh, man. I pitched that idea to uh, uh, Hino-san. I don't know if I told you this. I'm at the E3 that was part of uh, Nintendo's Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild exhibit. I met Hino-san, uh, the actual Akihiro Hino. And uh, I met him, we got a picture together, uh, we exchanged uh, information, and when his translators were there, I told him how much I loved Yokai Watch 1's little uh, kart racing, you know, the little bike racing thing. Uh, and then I said, it would be awesome if you could take the, the assets that you guys currently have and turn it into like a racing game. That would be so cool. Anyway, it didn't happen, but... I got to pitch my idea to Hinozan. That was awesome. All right, anyway, uh, this is uh, where Enterfly meant, right? Meow. Oh, Milky. We knew it was Milky instantaneously. What was that? Uh, it was a white cat. We got to chase him. Is this where we get Mineon? Because the white cat is actually a yokai? What, what, hold on, what's happening here? Oh my gosh, he turned into a yokai cat. Give me a sec. That cat, it's standing on two legs? Boldman? Uh, a yokai? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like he's taking a liking to you, Haley. Shoot. Be my friend and dye me in your clothes. That's what he's saying. I don't mind being friends, but dime in my colors? What? Did he say colors or clothes? I don't know. Hey, you guys. Are you in some sort of trouble, Nyan? Mr. E. Dang it. Who? Stern Yon? Hold on. Who in Tarnation? Is that you believable right there? No, that's Mr. Krabby Cat. I'm sorry. That's <laughs> Mr. Krabby Cat. I'm the wandering teacher, Mr. Krabby Cat. Nyan. Well, that's a practice sword. Dang. And that's a suit jacket. What in the world? Check this guy out. I don't know about that hair, but that jacket's pretty sweet. Nyan, nyan, nyan. Hmm, I see. You want to be dyed in her colors, Nyan. How wonderful. You're in the springtime of your youth, Nyan. In that case, you should use this app. Build a Nyan. All right. Build a Nyan. With this, you can dye this cat yokai in your colors. Okay, wow, look at that. Build and Yan is where you customize your own cat yokai. Choose Create and Yan in the Build and Yan app. Give it a name and customize its color, body, voice, and tribe. Alter your yokai shape and pattern or give it an accessory. Collect Origin Yan parts for Nyantastic makeover. Beige is so beige, why not red? Repaint your yokai with the color tool. Plus, super special skills and ultimates are available. Learn new moves with Train Anyan and set them with Skill Anyan menu. <laughs> Your yokai is inexperienced. It needs guidance from trainers. You can receive training from the cat yokai you've befriended. Use the Train Anyan option to learn ultimates and more. Different trainers can teach different skills and moves. But it takes three hours of real time to learn all that. To finish immediately, use an Origin Yan Essence. You can train stats up to five times. But if you simply must, use Ability Reset. Only stats are reset, not your yokai's moves. You can't reset life, but you can always train again. That's the long and short of it. Got it, Yan? No, that sounds fun. Perfect for me. In that case, let's give him a name first, Yan. Well, he's my original, so... Origin, Yan. Now, just you wait a gosh darn minute. You gotta give it more thought. Uh, how did you guess? No worries, I'll think about it again later. 
Well, I have a lesson to be teaching. So goodbye, everyone, Jan. Okay, bye-bye, okay, Mr. Krabby Cat. Hey, hey, with this app, I will dye you in my colors. Originion. <laughs> you sound like the the little fruit nyons. Originion's info added some medallion. Where are the random nicknames? Whitey, Blanco, Ghosty. <laughs> I don't know. Nyan. Okay. Uh, well, it's good we got the app, but he ain't the cat we've been looking for. Oh, there he is. Milky, this is him, Usapion, the cat our client was searching for. White coat and a red collar, just like she said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, he met Originion in Triangle Park, and they've been playing together. Oh, really? All right, then. Let's all go home. Nyan. So, cats can certain cats can see yokai, too. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, man. Nyan. There's Rocco, Enzo, Milo. No, I'm kidding. Probably Rocco and Enzo, but there's no orange cat. This guy's too popular. Okay, that was cool. Guys, we got our Originion. Don't even think about calling him Mineon anymore. That's it. That's out the window. Originion. So, we got some experience for doing that. 70 experience. Wow, this is a weak team. Holy moly. We got a cute bow, though. And Gizmo already wears a cute bow, so this is already perfect. Give me that large export, please. One more, one more, one more. Dang it, a mini export. Two of them. That's like nothing. It's trash. All right, whatever. Let me move. Aw, oh, dang. Excellent work. Here, please accept this. Fancy that. Issue 15. Whoa. Psych, it's a copy of Fancy That. This is, like, the best reward ever. I'm uh, glad you like it. Well, then, until next we meet. Well, that's another Tootin' request tackled. Piece of cake. Hmm. What's the matter? That last request for Mr. Goodsight, it was hardly fitting for a mystery detective agency, was it? I know what you mean, but there ain't nothing we can do about, uh, but wait right now. Oh, I guess. I bet most people don't even know we exist, which is why we're not getting any requests in, I reckon. I'd say you're right, so what are we gonna do about it? Ha ha ha. You always get my cows are running when you laugh like that, just tell me. Calm down, I have a cunning plan. We're gonna make a poster to advertise our detective agency. Well, I'll be. That's a darn sensible idea for once. We're bound to get more clients coming in if we put these up. So let's go. One moment, please. What's up? You'll need permission before you can put up posters in town. Aw, really? So where should we ought to go if we're fixing for some permission? You should head to the community center. Someone's bound to know there. Okay, let's go. Yeehaw. Alright, I don't want to go to the community center. I want to mess around with Gizmonyan. It's time for Gizmonyan. Alright, let's go with Manyan. Manyan. Buildingyan. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, in true tradition, we are going to call him Gizmonyan. Gizmonyan. Wait a second. I can't put Gizmonyan in there? Mm. Here, how about this? Oop. Gizmonyan. Dang it! Why is there only eight letters? That's lame. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. That's fine. You know what? That's cool. I don't remember what it what we were able to do with it in uh, the previous game, but sure. Oh! Cute! I don't even remember what Gizmonyan looked like, to be honest. Ugh! I guess we're gonna keep that. I got none. Where'd my bow go? Alright. Neckwear. Yeah! Boldman's got a bow! <laughs> I could name him Boldman. Uh, but that's okay. So, we're gonna go color. He's gonna be a brown tabby.
He wasn't that brown. Latte. Yeah, he's kind of a brown cat. I think that's cool. I don't remember what I did with him years ago. Body, tail, okay. Okay, let's go with voice. Yeah, I guess that's fine. Uh, mm, let's go Shady Tribe. So he can have um, synergy with uh, with the Sepion. Shady. I think that's okay. That looks pretty cute. <laughs> we'll get more stuff for him. Okay, so there's Train and Yan. I don't have a Yan to train with. Have Mr. Krabby Cat teach a skill or soul to Gizmonyan. He's gonna get defense up. Uh, killer comeback, rock slide. Rock slide? Hold on. <laughs> what game are we playing here, rock slide? Technique is rock slide. A defense up with Krabby Cat. Can I not use him if he's, uh... What is skill on Yan? A skill is miss you. Attacks become likely to miss? That's a terrible skill. Fire? We don't need fire. Pause a furry? Yeah, we need to get rid of that skill badly. All right, well, you know, Gizmonyan, we'll, we'll wait a little bit. Let me see. Can I put him out of the way, team members? Um, let's get Wazat the Hat out of here. What the heck are you doing here, Wazat the Hat? Get out. Oh, hold on. I gotta go to an IPO. Alright, so that was interesting. Uh, no, IPO's right outside. So, a little interesting there. I think in three hours we'll have a better skill. <laughs> yeah, you know what? We'll put him in the back row. Shady? Gizmonyan, come on, man. Let's go. Alright, so Gizmonyan's got pretty good stats. Alright, we'll put him in the back, and he'll just gain experience passively. That'll be fine. Okay, so where exactly are we going right now? Uh, let's see. So we got a new, uh, a new thing. Let's take a look at our quests. So we did that. Part of the story for her is going to be... Oh yeah, we gotta go to the community center. Okay, okay. We remember where the community center is, right? In case you guys don't remember the community center. That's over by... Uh, I guess we can go to Mount Wildwood? No, Breezy Hills is gonna be a little bit easier. No, I don't wanna go. That, and then I gotta go down the stairs. And then, uh, that's fine. We'll be okay. We got it. We got this, guys. Alright, so here we go. Running out of here. Right off the apartment porch. Mineon, Originion. Cute. Alright, so Gizmo can train to get rid of that ability. And then we're just gonna have to try to befriend some cat yokai. Like, cat yokai are just like the best yokai in the game. That's just what they are. And that's awesome. Because we love cats. Where's the Mirapo around here? What the heck? They're just not sprouting up yet? What are we doing? Okay, so community center is this way. We will cut through Triangle Park and we'll go straight to the community center. Okay, hello, Mr. I don't know, hello. Hello there, please take a seat. Uh, thank you. Anyway. Now, what can I help you with today? I want to put up these posters around town to advertise my detective I agency. May I see them first, please? Sure. Oh. oh, you've done a good job on these. A detective agency, indeed. So, uh, you're a detective, is that right? Yeah. That's right. I see. A kid detective, huh? Reminds me of when I was young. I was always playing 
at being a detective in the schoolyard. Okay, just one more thing. I just need you to sign here and we're done. Okay. Thank you. Good luck with you, your uh, investigations, kid. What we just signed, we didn't read it. And now that guy owns our entire business. <laughs> Alright, now let's get pasting some posters. Oh, where should we get pasting them first? Uh, we'll have to pick the right spots. So we got five posters of paste. Uh, that ain't many. Well, I didn't have much time. So we'll just have to find places where lots of people will see them. I've marked the best places on the map. Oh, darn tootin'. Okay, potential sites map. Okay. Uh, so we can now just follow the map and get them fixed into the walls. Uh, well, be careful with them. They took me forever to make. I can imagine. And why in the world is there a bathroom there? Okay. We will not put Haley on the toilet. Sorry. That's just not what we're doing. Okay, so where's the map? Where are the arrows? Okay, great. Oh, come on. Is that like a, a key item? What are we doing here? Oh, potential sites map. Yeah, here we go. Oh, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Okay, so Shrine Museum, Station, Hot Springs, Flower Road. Since we're here, we might as well go to Shrine. Okay, so Shrine, if I had a Mirapo, ooh, let's check the store if there's a Mirapo here. Come on, man. Like, where's the convenience at? There's got to be a creepy Mirapo in the bathroom. What in the world? Ah. Uh... I mean, it's lucky that we got the bike, but at the same time, come on, dude. All right, well, we're gonna ride our way over there. So, Mirapo all the way on the shrine. Oh, and plus, we've got to go talk to uh, Mr. E, right? Mr. E has all sorts of crazy stuff that he wants us to do, so. Nothing on the floor. Oh my gosh, you might as well just walk this entire spot rather than <laughs> trying to juggle to putting on the bike. All right. There's got to be somewhere nearby. Hey, Mr. E. You there. Hey. hey. It's that suspicious looking guy. Again. Oh, I'm not suspicious. I was waiting for you to come. What? This guy was lying in ambush again? Ooh. That looks like he's no ordinary guy. Suspicious guy. What is it this time? Whoa. Don't you guys want to go there to the yokai world? Yokai world? What yokai world? The yokai world he's talking about is the one of the worlds yokai live in. Yes. What? I'm very interested in that. Are you? Then let me show you the way. This way. If you see a creepy man with a mustache, oh boy. don't follow him. <laughs> We're here. It's a sacred tree of Mount Wildwood. What mysteries could lay hidden within? There ain't gotta be nothing. It's just a tootin' tree. Look closely. There. Was that? Now, just use the key and... <laughs> Why, hello there. Welcome to the Yokai Elevator. The Yokai Alligator? <laughs> so this explains why the tree has been so special to people through what the ages. You Will you quit your yappin', yapperin'? You Here, I'll leave you the key. So, we have access to like the end of the game in Yokai Watch 1, like right off the bat. Now you can use the elevator as much as you like. Anyway, in you get. Psych, here I go. <laughs> Next stop, the Yokai World. Where, in order to go into it, you must become a Yokai. Uh oh. I wonder if Haleyan has a Yokai for him. You know, like Futu and uh, Katie's Yokai? Mifu, right? <laughs> Welcome to the Yokai world. Follow the map and hand out posters? I'm not supposed to be here. I got posters to hand out. What are we doing? <laughs> We're getting sidetracked. Where are we? Uh, that's a dang nice building there. How did you teleport? Whoa. 
This is the fanciest restaurant in the yokai world, the Ambrosia Pavilion. Oh, it looks fancy. But the actual fanciest? Well, fancy that. Can we get some eats? Yes. <laughs> However, only those in possession of an invite may dine at this restaurant. If you don't have one, they won't even let you go inside. Uh, just what I expect from a fancy restaurant. Invitation only. They're looking down on us. The truth is, though, I'm the one who decides what kind of customers should be allowed in. Hmm. I like the look of you. I think it would be okay to give you some invites. Really? But I can only give you one a day. So if you're feeling fancy, just come and talk to me. If you do, I'll give you an invite. Oh, that's cool. Thanks, dude. Hook me up. Hey. Don't you want to go to the Ambrosia Pavilion? I can give you an invite if you want to go. Receive the invite. You must save your progress first. Yeah, sure. Wonderful. Let me give me these. Hey, sushi, sukiyaki invite. Oh. With the invite, you can eat the ultimate full course meal at the Ambrosia Pavilion. Enjoy yourself. I don't know if I want to go in. Like, we got stuff to do. Oh, fine. Let's, since we got a ticket. Pardon me, do you have an invite for the pavilion? Yes, I do. Thank you very much. Please come on in. Uh, is this going to be battles? A shop? I don't have money. Welcome. I see you have an invite to dine with us. This is the invite you'll be able to enjoy a top class dining experience. Our delicious sushi sukiyaki course. However, before you begin your meal, we require that you write in your diary. Use the sushi and begin the sushi course. I don't remember this at all. So, yeah, let's go. All right. I can get one every day, so I'll just log in and grab one. That's not too big of a deal. Okay, Myrmidana. Come on. Come on out, Master of Sushi and Sukiyaki. <laughs> destroy. Haha, <laughs> I'm gonna destroy your concept of food. Uh, why? I thought I was eating here. Then let us begin the meal. The first item on Sushi Sukiyaki course is... The healing soup with an EXP cream. Okay, now, uh, let us bring the dish. Here is the dish. Please enjoy the fragrance of healing with an EXP aftertaste. Oh, this looks delicious. Here we go. The yokai's HP and soul meters have been completely replenished. Okay, that was delicious. Uh-huh, there's something left at the bottom of the bowl. Oh, yeah! Okay! Okay! Yeah, next course is an assortment of bounties from Mellow Mountain. With this item, you will battle rare yokai picked in the mountain by our chef. However, we may leave out this course depending on your physical condition. Would you like to enjoy our assortment of bounties from Mellow Mountain? Why wouldn't you? I paid for it. Yes, please. Very well. Now let us bring in the dish. Kiwinyan! Kiwinyan! <laughs> Kiwinyan! Oh, it's so good. Give me this cat. I don't think I have Choco Bar. Please, eat up while they're fresh. Oh, oh come on! What is he gonna eat? I want a kiwi -nyan. And cinquetas! Oh gosh, these other rare yokai. Alright, well, let's take a look. I don't have any items. What do you like? You like choco bar, and you like juice. Dang, I don't think I have a choco bar. This could be a choco bar, a strawberry choco bar? Yeah, yeah, a strawberry choco bar, go. We might lose. Sing sing! Alright, give me this Kiwi Nyan right now. Burn him in the back. 27 damage is nothing. Ah, yuck. Slice, slice, done, man. I'm out. Uh, was happy with my strongest, and we're getting rocked right now. No one's there. I should have canceled it. I'm out! There's no way, I'm not strong enough. Uh, 
I'm not strong enough. I'm that headbutt. Hey, oh boy. team. Uh, I got a pretty good sandwich. Yeah, we're gonna do some work. This is like the B team right here. Uh, how do I do this one? <laughs> I keep on forgetting that. <laughs> I should have started off with hashtag soul to move, dude. Get him, guys! Come on, non-denominational. Let's go! Oh yeah, we got him. But I don't know if we got him, got him. We beat the level. That was tough, dude. I should have started out with that Sultan move to get them going. To get them to stop reacting. But we beat it. Great. Check out that. 97 experience points. Excellent. And we did get a Choco Bar. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Yeah, buddy! That's what I'm talking about right now, baby. We got a Kiwi Nyan. Squeeze me in your party and there will be juice for everyone. Become friends with Kiwi Nyan? Absolutely! Kiwi Nyan. That's it? So juicy! No, <laughs> Kiwi Nyan doesn't say so juicy anymore? What? <laughs> I don't know what the... Fuzz face? Kiwi Cat? Seedlin? Mikey? Hey, Mikey! Come on over, Fuzz face! Yo, we got a Kiwi Nyan! I hope Kiwinyan's a healer. I need a healer. <laughs> oh, oh Kiwinyan. Yo, this is good. This is really good. We're gonna keep Kiwinyan on the team. Nervous. Now we will move to the final dish. The final course is our famous sushi sukiyaki feast. Now, let us prepare the dish. Ooh. This is our famous sushi sukiyaki feast. Okay, special food that captivates a palate of every yokai that eats it. Enjoy. Okay. The sushi sukiyaki course is now complete. Thank you very much for coming. We hope to see you again soon. All right, so once a day, you come on over here and you get the best food? Oh, man, you bet. Hello. Disliking. Uh, look at this guy. Disliking. Hey, the Castellius is. Ambrosia, Pavilion. You can go sit and talk to those guys. All right, how about you? Who are you? Oh, this is a, a shell celebrity. Okay. Cool. They're... Uh, snobbity? Alright, yeah, look at these two! Hey, guys! I'm having a good time, can't calm down. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What do you think, honey? Best date ever, right? Worth a little effort getting my hands on those invites. Oh, dude, you can say hi to all these yokai. Who in the world are you? Pearly white? <laughs> wow, what a strange person with a heart as black as their teeth. Don't you think you better be uh, shined to a teeth like mine? Alright, how about you? Oh, this is the ugly duck. Tip. Professor Plumage? Oh, interesting. Okay, so Camp Cavity is talking with the other one. Ha uh, ha ha, stop brushing your teeth. And this is uh, Sheen, cool. Legendary Blade. And this is Steak King, right? Well done. Yeah, Steak King. Yeah, I, didn't I name him Steak King? I know I did. In Yokai Watch 3 JP. See, like, we're thinking alike. Steak King. Steak King. Okay, we got Vicumary. Awesome. I'm gonna eat his food. And then, uh, your boy Master. Your Master. 
Okay, cool, cool. All right, this was awesome. You get to see the little yokai just interacting with each other. We got Kiwi Nyan. Oh man, dude, this is awesome. So here's the thing, right? You're not guaranteed to get Kiwi Nyan every single time. So I'm on a fence as, you know, should I use Kiwi Nyan in the Let's Play? I think I should. I think I should. I, I don't know. It's debatable, because if you guys are playing this game right along with me, and you go into there and you don't get Kiwi Nyan to spawn, and you, then you don't get him, then you can't really play hand-in-hand -hand with me in this Let's Play walkthrough. But then again, you can get Kiwi Nyan if you try and try again. No Either way, individual results may vary. <laughs> Welcome to the human realm. I got myself a Kiwi Nyan, dude. Thank you so much. I'm going to come back to this place every day, and I'm going to try some stuff. All right, I got to go to an IPO. Uh, Blazion got rocked right off the bat. Dude, hashtag Sultimate move is like so good. I need to use that a lot more often. You start off the battle with hashtag Sultimate move and everyone gets rocked. And there's a Mirapo. And there's a piece of, oh, who in the world is this? This is uh, like Acorny, or what is his name? What is his name? Something like an acorn. You think I care about getting hit by that one thing? I don't. Just focusing on this nonsense guy. Oh, now he's upset. Why am I even doing this? You think I need this guy? What's his name? Swaycorn. Okay, I knew it was something acorny. <laughs> acorny, Abdallah. Good job. Swaycorn. All right, well, we might as well try to befriend some yolkmen. So let's go into preparation. Target. What do you like? You like veggies. I may have a cucumber. I may not have a cucumber. But I'll give you my sukiyaki feast if you're cool with that. Just beat him up. Oh, pew! Gone. 24 rock damage. Are you joking right now? How is he so bulky? There we go. Is Usapian like weak against rock or something? What are we doing here? 10 experience points for that. That's not even worth the time I took to find him. All right, whatever. Give me this thing in the back. Oh, an iron doll. Great. And this is the Mirapo. Where are we going? No, we, we're we at the shrine. We have work to do. Hold on. Let me put my... Let me heal my Yolkai. And then we're going to put uh, a Kiwinion on our team. Like, get out of here, Blazion. Let's take a look. What level is Kiwinion? 15. Oh, man. What does he do? He doesn't heal. Dang it. He's a uh, rock slide, fur coat... Uh, stubble barrier. He's a tank class. Feels like. Alright, yeah, I guess that's cool. He's uh, a charming tribe, so let's put him on the team. He's level 15. What's his defense? 36? Oh, dude, he's way better than this guy. And he's got very... Yeah, he's very good. He's bulky. Sorry, Tweeter. You're just done. Although, I could put both of them in. That's the, that's an E-rank tweeter, man. Or treater, whatever his name is. Yeah, I don't know. Dude, not a nuts trash, though. So, we're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna get rid of him, and then we're just gonna switch around some teammates. So, I'm gonna put you up front as my tank, because you're very bulky with 36 and 46. Imagine if I gave him the Paradise Ball. He'd be unstoppable. So we got really lucky, and I think Ki and Yan we're gonna take to end game. So I'm gonna mess around. We're gonna we're gonna hold on to him for a little bit. I'm sorry, I have to go to the shrine. I'm sorry, I have to go to the cranky guy. <laughs> How many cranks do I have today? Cranks today's cranks. You know I don't actually care about cranks. Here, change this. Get out of here. Take aim and fire. Let's go. Really? Shoot it. I'm not going to. No, absolutely not. Dude, save all your coins for the American Dream uh, ru Dream Roulette. It's not even worth cranking over there. Unless you're like desperately in need of yokai, just don't even do it. 
All right, so we need to go to the shrine, guys. Here we go. Talk to the old man. Here we go. Hi there. Have you come to the shrine? Yeah, we'd like to put up a poster about our detective agency. I see. Then please, paste it on the shrine notice board over there. It's the best place where people can see it. Thank you very much. Happy to help. And before you go, here's a little something for you. Talisman. Potato chips? Don't accept potato chips from an old man. Wow, thanks so much. Oh, use it well. It's the guy that sells talisman. Okay, awesome. This is great. Let's hope that it'll get more clients to come a-calling. You just wait, we're gonna be overrun. Okay, so now we're out of here. I need to go to a couple different places. Uh, let's see if we can warp over to the museum. I'm gonna warp to my house. And then we're gonna come on down, we're gonna go to the museum, which is our uh, number two. One of them's at the station, and then there's two of them in Blossom Heights. So we should be all set that way. And then I think it's good, it's a good spot to end off the episode once we're done putting up all the posters. I don't know if that's gonna be the end of the chapter, but uh, we'll, we'll have to take a look. All right, team, we got a key winion. Yo, you can't have a win without key winion. Let's go. I'm excited about key winion, man. We are about to win this. All right, so I gotta go inside the museum and say, hey, look, I wanna do some free advertising. You. Director. Excuse me, could I possibly put up one of these posters here in the museum? Let me see, is this some sort of advertisement? Uh, yeah, it's for my detective agency. Go on, please. Uh, well, alright. But please paste it along with the other posters in the exhibit wall. Great, thank you. Okay. That was awesome. <laughs> Gord Pond Museum, done. So let's go to the south. Uh, downtown Springdale. And then we should be all set. Out of the way, dude. Let's go through the tunnel. Ooh, what's on the manhole cover? Oh, it's a one-star coin fragment. Wow, I might as well sell that for 10 cents of what it's worth. All right, here we go. Riding, riding. Okay, so we are gonna go to the station and talk to the people inside the station and see what's up. All right, where's the person with the exclamation mark on your head? Is it not here? Okay, it's maybe one of these guys. You! Excuse me! Hello, young lady, how can I help? I would like to put up a poster, if you don't mind. May I see the poster first, please? I see, yeah, that should be no problem at all. I'll paste it on the glass wall over here for you. That way lots of people should see it. Well, if it's that easy, let's go. Okay, here we go. We are gonna go all the way to blah. Oh, hold on, gate of whimsy, gate of whimsy, gate of whimsy, gate of whimsy, baby. Yeah, one does not simply walk past the gate of whimsy. You need them. You gotta help out Diana Gately. You don't even know about Diana Gately. Best NPC in the game. All right, let's jump on in. We always do. We have to. Whenever you see, like, your yokai radar flash in purple, you always have to see what's going on. Oh, we're in a church. Interesting. East Pine Church. What's going on here? Oh, that's cool. I have no clue, to be honest. This is really creepy. Oh, man. This is Thomas. All right. Do you vow? Huh? Well, what are you saying all of a sudden? Do you vow? He's just saying the same thing. If I don't answer him, I don't think we're going anywhere. Do you vow? Uh, swear. Who am I gonna get married to? I do. What? You can't make a vow if you don't know what you're vowing. Only the truthful will meet with good fortune. Think harder before you answer next time. Do you be jealous? <laughs> what? If your best friend got a handsome boyfriend, do you be jealous? No. I wouldn't be jealous. That heart you have, celebrating for the fortune of others. It's mighty fine. Well, you want to use it? What? I got some good medicine here. <laughs> do you want to use it? Oh, 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 look at his eyes. No, you do not do that. No, 
absolutely not if you see a guy regardless of if it's in a church if you see a guy that looks like this <laughs> oh i got some good medicine here you want to use it oh no i don't what you're a kid ain't you you can take something if it's offered to you that's against the doggone principles of childhood are they close close are bbq and springtail close well, close is subjective. That's a subjective term. That's not objective at all. Not close. They aren't. Darn tootin'. BBQ and Springdale are mighty far away. Now, you wash your hands? Wash my hands? You wash your hands when you get in from playing outside? Yeah, I do. I do wash my hands. That's what I like to hear. When you come back from outside, you gotta wash your hands so you don't catch cold. Now, tasty pasta? What? That isn't even a question. <laughs> this is the best bizarre room. Tasty pasta? Um. Uh. You ain't good at deciding, are ya? If you want to eat some, just say so, Dag Nabbit. I done asked you some questions to test ya. Now I know. There's a demon living in your heart. I can't trust you. Get along home. Huh? How unreasonable. What are you talking about? The demons. All right. There's a demon living in your heart. Get out of my church. <laughs> Looks like the pastor done made his mind up. Looks like we ain't getting anywhere this time. What? Exit the gate of whimsy. Come on. No. Just because I didn't accept your pasta, pastor? Man, you got another thing coming. You straight up got another thing coming. Come here. Whatever you're holding back, the gate globes, give them to me. Shoot. What? Are you kidding me? Yeah, I, I, he's not gonna do anything. Fine, fine. Maybe if I pester him a lot enough there's a demon living in your heart get out of my church he made up his mind looks like we won't get it Shoot. maybe you talk to him 20 times and then he Shoot. maybe there's something in the uh the little crowd here come on dude what because i didn't take your medicine oh man no you know what i'm gonna walk out of here with my principles no forget you dude forget it i'm done with you unbelievable <laughs> Although that was really funny. Alright, hey, check that out. Crawling. Okay, that was weird. Alright, so we pasted that up. That was a really, really funny bizarre room. Apparently you have to answer the questions correctly. And you gotta accept the pastor's pasta. And you gotta take his medicine. Get out of here, man. No. Regardless of if you're a pastor in a church, dude. If you're a kid... And someone's someone's trying to give you medicine? No, absolutely not. That's how you die, you know. <laughs> oh. Oh, anyway, here we go in Shoppers Row. Why am I in Shoppers Row? I gotta go to Blossom Heights. We can go to Laundromat. Maybe find, we'll find Snartle over there. Or sorry, a Snottle. Snottle. Your boy Snottle, not Snartle. That was hilarious, though. No, that was a good laugh. I enjoyed that one thoroughly. All right, so uh, remind me again where I'm going over here. We're not going to Birdhouse. Uh, inventory, we are going to the key items. Potential sites map. Hot Springs and Flower Road. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. So we did need to go to Flower Road. All right, so we're going to go to the Hot Springs. We're going to talk to one of our other favorite NPCs, uh, the lady at the front counter at the Hot Springs. She was one of my favorites in Yokai Watch 2. If she's the still person, same person. Yeah, 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 Springs girl. That's right, her. Welcome, how can I help you today? Uh, can we please paste a poster here for a detective agency? Oh, can I see it? I love the cute rabbit character. Did you make that up yourself? Oh, well. I'll paste it on the ground floor for you. People are bound to see it there. Oh, thank you. Hang on a sec. Have a refreshing drink to thank you for visiting us today. Yo, milk! That's great. Oh, yeah, they're known for amazing milk in the Hot Springs area. You can get that, like, maybe two or three of them a day in the previous games. Okay, that's a little... Uh, I like that a lot. 
All right, so there's uh, probably not a gate, gate of Whimsy, but it seems like there's a yokai over here watching TV. Oh, a baffle board. I don't know if I want to do this yet. I'll reveal it, but I probably don't have this yokai. You guys can play along with. Here's a baffle board. Okay, Heartful Tribe runs an in. Incredibly dexterous hair. Mm, I'm sorry, I don't know. He runs an in. Sternion? Mr. Krabby Cat? I don't know. Well, we know that there's a baffle board there, and that's pretty cool. So you guys can let me know in the comments what, what yokai that is, and maybe we'll revisit it later. That's a post-game thing, man. We're not don't don't worry about you, too much about that. Alright, so here we go. Let's jump on down to the shoppers row, flowers road. And then once we're in Flowers Road, or Flower Road, we should be able to find someone to post up our last thing and we'll call it an episode. All right, here I am. Oh, this guy looks mean. This is the beef dude, right? Oh, uh, you wanna put the poster up? Yes, this is the poster. Hmm, detective agency. I think I may just have to repossess this. Repossess? You mean you're seizing my poster? You don't have a right to take it from me just because you don't like it. Do you always just take stuff which you disapprove of? I'm repossessing it. I'm gonna repossess everything. Uh, not if I have anything to do with it, you're not. I spent ages on that poster. There's definitely a yokai behind this. Well, if that's what you think, then, you better get searching and see if you can see one. Alright, well. This is interesting. Who's here? Oh, gosh, that's the Angry House? Whoa, I remember the Angry House yokai. I don't know his name, though. Something about repossessing? I don't know, man. Here we go. Wait a darn toot in second. That's Repossessor. Meaning you've been in spirit this whole darn time. Repossessor? What do you mean by snatch snatching my poster off me? Because I can. Is that the only reason? And after I put so much time and effort into it? You're gonna take it from me just because you can? Well, you got another thing coming, Repossessor. We're about to repossess you. Let's go. We got a new Kiwi that we're gonna beat up, beat y'all up with. Here we go. I don't know what this does. Oh, it makes everyone like tougher or something? I should have read the description on that. Stubble Barrier. Yeah, okay, so that's pretty cool. So he's able to do that work uh, where he's going to make himself even more defensive. And you can start that off and then have everyone hide behind him, pretty much. That's pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. So he's a pretty good tank on our team right now. I mean, Treater. Treater was a pretty good tank. But this guy's an even better one. Alright, so that one's done. And that one's done. I even used, like, Hail, like the ice attack on him, and knocked him out. Wow. Sorry, Repossessor. Oh, Manyan leveling up. Okay, Boiled Egg. Oh, my head. Whew, I thought I'd never get my poster back then. What do you mean someone wanted to destroy this beautiful poster? Yeah, can you think of anything worse? Who could do such a thing? Well, you, you varmint. Do you mind if I paste this poster up? I really like it. Do you mean it? Yes, please. That would be great. Okay. Hung in Flower Road. We're done at last. Now I'm tootin' tuckered out. Let's head on home. Darn tootin'. I don't know why you're so tired, Usafian. I did all the work. Come again, partner? Who helped you find places to paste them old posters up all day, then? Uh, well, I already marked them on the map, so... Well, I suppose you did actually help me find some good spots to put them. Darn tootin' I did. Anyway, let's head on home. Oh, come on. You mean I gotta teleport home? I gotta, I gotta walk home? No fade to black? I go home? Alright, whatever. Who knows? Maybe we might find another Gate of Whimsy. Or another thing. Look at all these things up here. Like, I can get them, right? Oh, but then that dog's gonna bark. No, nah, forget that. He's hiding a lot of cool stuff. But, like, I'm not... I don't really care for those items. I don't need them. Alright, so... The fastest way to warp home... Is there not a station warp? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got a rematch here? 
You want a rematch? You want a rematch? You gonna invite me into your church again? All right, let's go. Let's go, pastor. I will eat that pasta. I will take your medicine if it gives me gate globes. It's you believable, man. That's you believable what just happened here. All right, here we go. Gate, gate of whimsy number two. I hope that we can get it. Oh gosh, another bizarre room. Great. What's going on here? All right. Oh, there's a cat in the... Oh, this is awesome. Are you kidding me right now? This is so cool. You have to say, like, who you are. Jibanya! Whisper, hey guys! Huh? Nyan, yo, what's wrong, Nyan? You're different than usual, Nyan. Nyan, you're not hungry, are you? If you are, let's eat, Nyan. I want to eat a chocolate bar, too. Uh, nice to meet you. Nyan, yeah. yeah, what sort of greeting do you call that, Nyan? But I thought we'd be together forever. How could you forget me? I bet you've been inspirited by a yokai again, haven't you? Like I said, Nya, I'll nyan that yokai anyway if you give me a choco bar. Oh, this is so cool! You can see like the house. That's the way out. There's a. Is I don't I don't understand whose house whose room is this? Is this Katie's room? I don't know. I never played as like Katie. And maybe I did. Yeah, Yoka Witch too. Huh, are you going out? Leave it to me, your trusted yokai butler, to provide some cheerful companionship. Oh, that's not your usual reaction. Is there something wrong? You've got a troubled look about you. Uh, where is this? What are you talking about? Have you forgotten your own room? It's the same cutie girl, girly room it always is. Oh dear, have you woken up yet? Pull it together. Huh, don't you think it's the work of a yokai? Only joking, there's no way, is there? <laughs> this is totally Katie, right? Uh, you're feeling all right. You don't seem your usual self. Is your memory back to normal? Can you tell me what you remember? Like, do you know where you are, who your friends are, who you're meeting with? Do you remember who you are? I am. I am. You gotta be Katie. Yeah, Katie's here. Woohoo! Best Katie. Best girl Katie right here. Bizarre room not clear for that church one. I thought it was like, all right, teaching you life lessons. Don't accept medicine from strangers. Clear. But no. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is happening here? Well, you know what? Oh, wow, a police car. I'm out of here. See ya. Running from the law. Okay, so we know that there's a, a potential gate of whimsy right over here. So that's pretty interesting. Where were the other warps? There were three warps on screen. There was one at the shrine or something. All right, whatever. We're just gonna take the way out. Watch this awesome trick. Check this trick out. You guys ready? Oh gosh, nope. Oh, here's a trick. Yeah! Oh man, yeah, that's right. You guys saw that? Anyway, so, I don't know. I'm still a little salty bacon. I think a salty bacon's in spirit of me right now for messing up that church one. What the heck, dude? My next question of the day should be, like, if a pastor were to offer you medicine, <laughs> would you take it? Uh, well, he's supposed to be trustworthy, right? I don't know. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop before I get myself in trouble. Anyway, <laughs> I think that's too funny. All right, anyway. You do not take medicine from strangers, regardless of who they are and, or, or what stature they're from. Anyway, let's get out of here. I'm going to go to bed. What the heck? No, I need to go to bed. Maybe I should take it. Why am I? Why am I? Oh, it's a go home to rest. Yeah, let's sleep until morning. Let's see what's up. We are at the hour mark. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. You guys are great. Okay, we're going to the detective agency again today. I'm wondering if we'll find ourselves uh, some more requests. Joshua. Hey, sis. Why are you out all the time lately? Joshua? It's not like I care. I expect you're up to something, uh, to some freak stuff as usual. I don't know what you're talking about. I've just been out playing. 
What? When you usually spend all day reading comics and stuff at home? Hey. Uh, anyway, where are you off to now? Mind your own business. Now stay here and don't you dare follow me, widow baby Joshi. Like I want to follow a freak like you. Besides, I promise to go play down at the Gourd Pond. Because unlike you, sis, I have loads of friends. Well, good for you. Anyway, I'm leaving. Bye. If you're up to anything weird, I'm gonna tell Mom. I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, later. Get to the detective agency. I think we might. Yeah, I don't know. Is that gonna be the end of the chapter? Like, I don't... I don't know. Like, I wouldn't want to end the episode off right now if it's not the end of the chapter, you know? Anyway, so let's go to the detective agency Sparkopolis, and we will fly there. Hey, what do you know? I think we can go a little bit more. We'll go a little bit more, and then we'll see. Okay, so it's raining out. Maybe there's some yokai that like the rain. Who knows? Hello, Waper. Any requests today? Nothing yet, I'm afraid. But that can't be. Uh, guessing even the posters didn't grab much interest then. Let's just wait a bit longer for Someone's bound to turn up. Ain't nothing gonna dampen your spirits, is there, Haley? A request? What in tarnation? There ain't nobody here. I was bored, so I made a blog about the detective agency. A blog? Uh, then I had Treater start posting about my blog online, and now it's gone viral. I want to see this darn blog you're talking about. Show me, Dagnabbit. See, look how awesome it is. Hmm, those little mushroom dudes. What in tarnation? My face is <laughs> looks like a darn champy. We get to the bottom of every mystery. Well, Champy's more popular than you are, so... A great idea, if I do say so myself. You varmint! You better quit your messing, because you're making me madder than a wet hen. Okay. Hello. This is the Hapion Detective Agency. Yeah, yeah. You like us to carry out an investigation? Yes, right, of course. Psych, we got a request, and now we're going to be much busier. Come on, Sapion, look sharp. I'm listening, you barman. So, uh, these are requests that uh, we've received. Let's get on with the darn investigation, Tag Nabbit. Okay, new quest available. Okay, so this is a perfect time to stop the episode. So we got some new quests available. I'm going to come over here, and we're going to save the game with this Ipo. Or actually, we're going to heal up. Uh, which is really good. And then we should be able to save over here. And we're going to stand out in the rain. We're going to call it a day. So that was awesome. Today's episode was great. We did two bizarre rooms. We got ourselves a Riginyan. Uh, what else happened? I'll have to rewatch the episode. Oh, we got Kiwinyan. We found out every day you can go to Mount Wildwood and talk to Mr. E and get a VIP ticket to go inside the yokai world and dine for some rare yokai. How cool is that? That's so cool. I am actually so super psyched about that. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like, okay? Would you guys like to see two episodes in one day? Yeah, if you would. How about we get to 500 likes in this episode and I'll upload two episodes today. That'd be pretty cool, huh? I know you'd like that. I know you would. Anyway, so uh, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you guys didn't already answer a comment question today, do so. Who is your favorite Sailor Cutie? I think on the next episode, I'm going to talk to you guys about the Originyan. Hmm, what are you going to name your Originyan? Are we all going to jump on board and name him Gizmonyan for the sake of Gizmo? We could. Or you can name him whatever you want. So, anyway, uh, watch our newest video on the channel that way. Recommendations there. Playlist. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you guys are all updated on the latest and greatest Yokai Watch 3 content on YouTube. Right here. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys on the next one. Take care.